I know you're wondering, why is he tapping his head? Why is he tapping it? Why is he tapping it harder? That's that's just because I'm trying to wake up my brain. I'm trying to wake up your brain. Let me tap your... Mm, let me tap your fucking head. Let me tap it again. You want to know why I'm tapping your fucking head? Because your brain needs to explode with thoughts. You want to know what thoughts those are? The, the thoughts are is uh, making your own damn business. That's what I'm talking about. Making your own damn business or working for yourself. Uh, this video goes out to the extremely, extremely young people out there before you waste all your time doing this and doing that and doing this and doing that. You got to think to yourself, maybe I need to make my own thing go on. And I know it's easier said than done. But for those that are not lazy, make your own fucking business. And guess what? If you make a t-shirt company, make sure not to make a company that's like this. Make a stupid shirt like this that I only wear indoors because it's fuck. It's fucking garbage. Do you understand? This is garbage. And I just noticed, why in the fuck, when I spit, is there red? <laughs> I guess I, I, okay, I brushed my, okay, am I dying? Did I brush my, I think I brushed my teeth a little too hard today. <laughs> oh my, that shit is so fucking funny, dude. I'm like, what the hell? Why is blood coming out of my fucking mouth? It's either I'm dying or I probably brush my teeth way too fucking hard. That's And that's the funny part is that I do that a lot. My gums are actually extremely, like, pussy. And sometimes, I don't know why. I don't. I, I always want to brush my teeth, like, fast and, and aggressive. And I shouldn't do that because then it causes a little tiny bit to bleed or something like that. But, okay, Criminal Juice is dying. That's the next video clip. But anyways, make your own business, okay? Don't make this shirt because I'm going to keep spitting on it with blood, okay? Please don't do that. But, um, I'm actually trying to look for the blood now. Anyways, um, yeah, so what I was saying was make your, <laughs> this video is already weird and awkward. And guess what? Another, another fake person would have 100% edited this whole thing out. They would have been like, let take this out, dude. This was really bad. So we spit on your shirt without blood. And I'm like, no, I want everybody to see that I'm dying. But anyways, um, so this is for not the non-lazy people, the people that are not like me, because for some reason, it's not that I'm lazy, it's just nowadays, I don't know what it is. But if you could start a, sh a fucking shirt company, just think about anything you could think about in the goddamn world that you can buy and then resell online, get fucking uh, cryptocurrency, do anything besides getting a regular nine to five job where they're gonna pay you complete garbage money. And if you are gonna get a job, do some fucking Postmates or something like that where you could just work on your own and make your own goddamn schedule because this, the best part about those jobs is that while you're doing that type of job where you could just work whenever the hell you want, It'll give you time to do the stuff that you're really passionate about and the stuff that you really want to do on the side as well. Because when you have a schedule, now you have to be on that schedule. And a lot of the times when you're on a schedule, it makes you really pissed off. And also, like let's say you have to start your day off in the morning with work. It usually takes away all your creativity time because in the morning is the time when you're the most creative, believe it or not. And a lot of times when people go to work, then they come home, they're already completely drained and their and their creativity is is fucking done. Like seriously, the creativity is is fucking like I don't know, man. It just sucks. I, I know all about that because I don't know. I feel like doing a goddamn thing. I just look at my guitar. Uh, and if you don't think I, I have one. Anyways, I just look at my guitar and I'm like, no. And then I just go to sleep. <laughs> And then I wake up and do the same thing. Robot, robot, I'm going to work. Hello, how are you doing? Uh, Criminal Juice, can you go get me that? Sure, sir, I will get you that. Would you like me to wipe your ass as well? Sure. It just turns you into a robot to the point where you're not even human at all anymore. So for the ones that are have some money and they don't have to do a goddamn thing, I suggest you invest in yourself and figure out a way that you can make a bunch of money because goddamn, there's so many, there's so many people out there making thousands and thousands of dollars of something 
I don't know what it is. You could sell books. You could sell your cock hairs. You could sell your panties. If I was a fucking girl, I would sell some used panties straight up and down. I would make so much money off that shit. I don't give a fuck. Uh, I would do that. Maybe, maybe there's there's a thing for used guy underwear. I need to look into that. You see, that's what I mean about the laziness. I don't care about that stuff. I'm more into making content and stuff, and I hope one day this actually works out in some way. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I could still go back to prostitution, charging $25 a blow. It doesn't matter to me. It's totally fine. And I was very, very good at that. I used to make at least 50 quarters a day doing that. So there you go. But, uh... Yeah, just do that. Just do that and try that out too. Be a Postmates person. Deliver food. You could do it on foot. Oh, I don't have a bike. Good excuse. You could do it on foot, you fucking asshole. You could do a lot of things out there. There's even people that cuddle for money. Yes, you can be a professional. A professional cub, a cuddler. But think about that. You could be a professional cuddler. And there's an actual site. That all you do is go there and you cuddle. And we know you're probably going to have... They're going to be like, hey, dude, uh, how about a $200 tip? And I'm like, a $200 tip for what? So I can have that $200 tip of your dick. And then you give it to them. And you're like, oh, yeah, you like that, you like that. And then the next time you see them, you're like, well, I don't think $200 is good. How about $300? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And then you fuck them and stuff. That's if you want to, you know, because obviously, let's be honest with each other. Those people that are that desperate to cuddle with someone, they're going to want to. And the only reason you hear that noise is because you're fucking them in the ass and you put lube in it. Because that's the sound it makes. It sounds like farting sounds. Um, whatever. Anyways, make your own business. Do your own thing. Go for your passions. Make sure you go for your passions because then in life, later on in life, you might end up stuck somewhere in a job where you can't do absolutely nothing. But you don't have to be stuck because even if you do have to work and you have to do bullshit, get a Postmates job or something like that. Even if you drive, do Uber, do something. I know or something like that. Yeah, do something like that because guess what? You can do it at any time you want. You can do it at four in the fucking morning if you want to do that job. You understand? It gives you time to do everything else. When you're on a strict schedule that takes away everything from the from your life, then that's going to fuck you over, baby, baby. Uh. And, and you're welcome for those that just turn into millionaires listening to what I got to tell you. But criminal, you're not a... Well, unfortunately, I'm not a millionaire because everything I do is extremely hard to get anywhere at, okay? Creating content, all this stuff is pretty hard. But guess what? I love doing it. If I made you smile once, if I made you horny once... Whatever it is, even if I made you vomit, even if I made you look at me and go, this guy looks like Osama Bin Laden, even though the, I know the only reason you're saying that is because you're trolling me, because I do not look like Osama Bin Laden. I could make a video. You know what? After this video, I'm going to make a video of Osama Bin Laden and my face right next to his, and I'm going to compare it to see I look nothing like him. All right? That's the next video I'm going to literally make. For all you fucking stupid trolls out there that keep calling me that. Anyways, there's... A, oh, wait. There's another there's another business idea I have for you. You should be in the business of subscribing. Criminal Juice, sometimes when you scream, your mic sounds horrible. I know! I know it sounds terrible. Because I'm using a fucking uh, a camera and I'm using the mic on it. And I like the way it sounds bad when it cracks. If you're wondering why. But anyways, you should be in the business of subscribing to me. Thank you. Thanks. Suck it.